practices. What's happening at the moment is that materialists are jumping ship. They're, they're leaving, they're, they're defecting from this worldview. One of the leaders in this movement was uh, Galen Strawson, the British philosopher of mind, who wrote a key paper about five or six years ago called Does Materialism Imply Panpsychism? And he answered yes. Now, panpsychism is the belief or doctrine or philosophy that psyche, mind, is present everywhere throughout nature. Pan means everywhere, psychism means mind or psyche. That um, nature, it, there's a kind of element of mind or, or psyche, even in electrons and atoms, that um, the argument here is that you can't have consciousness emerge in human brains unless the matter that it emerges from already has some kind of primitive form of consciousness or lower level consciousness. Otherwise, if you just say it appears miraculously when a brain reaches a certain size, it's another kind of dualism. You just have mechanism and then a kind of miraculous appearance of consciousness that's unexplained. A more recent convert to panpsychism was Thomas Nagel, a Britain's, uh, uh, the US, uh, the America's leading philosopher of mind at um, Columbia in New York. And Nagel wrote a book a couple of years ago called Mind and Cosmos, Why the Materialist Neo-Darwinian Conception of Nature is Almost Certainly False. Now this story stirred up a furore in the New York Review of Books, the New York Times, and in the, in the kind of intellectual world in America. The, the, the materialist camp, people like Steven Pinker, Daniel Dennett, and so on, were absolutely furious, and, and, and they denounced him in, in the most intemperate language. But Nagel's book is a very fascinating book because here's somebody who is as an atheist and was a kind of materialist who just realizes you see him thinking out loud in this book. And he ends up by saying we need a completely new kind of science. And what's more, we need a theory of evolution that sees purpose in the way evolution has occurred, both on li in life on Earth and in the cosmos. Fascinating to see this tremendous turnaround. The latest... Um, panpsychist, the person who left materialism to join the panpsychist camp, is one of the most hardcore of the materialists in California, Christoph Koch, who was uh, at California Institute of Technology. Um, he worked with Francis Crick um, on consciousness and the brain. And he came out about six months ago in an article in Scientific American arguing for panpsychism as the way forward. Now, this is a fascinating thing, you see, that there's, there's the, the, the materialists, the most hard-called materialists, are going over to an idea there's some kind of mind in nature, which is not very different from animism, which is what the scientific revolution start, started off by rejecting, the idea of a living world, a living nature. And another straw in the wind is that uh, Sam Harris, who's one of the so-called new atheists, one of the... Uh, new Atheists. In 2006, this torrent of atheist books, da uh, Richard Dawkins, The God Delusion, Sam Harris, The End of Faith, Daniel Dennett, Breaking the Spell, Christopher Hitchens, God is Not Great, Why Religion Poisons Everything. Um, this, t this tsunami of atheist uh, uh, literature uh, uh, came out and, and sort of took over the sort of chattering classes for a while. Um, but uh, Sam Harris, one of these four new atheists, has a book coming out this week called Waking Up, Spirituality Without Religion. He's gone over to spirituality and comes out in favor of a kind of Buddhism light. Um, and so uh, it's a fascinating transition. The, we're in a time of extraordinary change at the moment. The, 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 the hardcore people in the materialist camp are, are, are changing their tune. Dennett still soldiers on. Um, maintaining the faith. In England, Richard Dawkins has become a figure of fun and is now a kind of standard uh, figure of fun in satires and cartoons for his extreme levels of bigotry and intolerance. And, and so this is, it's a very interesting moment we're in. Now, when, as soon as